Mm. 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 Oh. Mm. Yeah. They teleport me back to Kerala. Mm. Wow! Whoa. What's up guys, David Hoffman here from David's Been Here, coming at you from Sharjah, UAE. Today I'm super excited because I'm here with Minority Taste, Rosena, and Trevor James from the Food Range. Hey guys! And we're going to go on an all out food tour. We're doing a mix of street food, Emirati, Indian. I'm super excited, I'm pumped. You guys ready? Let's go! Let's do it. <laughs> so this is like the business district, right? So all brand new buildings, we got a fountain here. And this is where we're starting off right here. We're gonna have some Emirati breakfast. I'm super excited, I'm starving. It's already 10 a.m. Let's go! You ready? Let's go, man. Let's do it. It's gonna be good. <laughs> Rosanna, what is this place? What's this restaurant name? So this is called Alfana. Alfana is one of the oldest and the most traditional Emirati places. And uh, you know, like they don't serve a lot of Emirati cuisine in UAE. So this place is the spot. But from my understanding, what happens is because the Emiratis usually eat this at home, right? So it's not like in restaurants. They eat a lot of cuisine at their place. So that's very rare to find Emirati restaurants here. That's why there's so much Indian cuisine, right? <laughs> <laughs> but you love it. Oh, I love it. I can't wait. We're going to finish it in style today. Oh, wow. It's going to be like a long day. <laughs> long day with lots of food and we're going to stuff David. <laughs> <laughs> I'm ready. I can't wait. Let's do this. Let's do it. Tomato balalit, Emirati tray. Yeah. And one... Uh, lamb nash nafshe, nafshe. Uh, we're gonna get something healthy as well <laughs> these are not uh, emirati but then they've like added yeah. it to yeah, yeah. this place okay. this is the lamb nashe it's cooked in a very aromatic potato and uh, aromatic curry and then they also have the uh, barota it's a parota but they call it barota <laughs> what do we have here Rosanna? so this is the bala leet. it's kind of a sweet vermicelli noodle with egg oh nice yeah so this is also like an egg and tomato dish that they it's, a it's not a shakshuka it's their version of the shakshuka okay yeah foul Full. Full. Oh, fava bean. Yeah. Uh, fava bean. Yeah, ex exactly. And chickpea. Chickpea. So it's a karak. Yes. Yeah. This is the karak. Karak is very, very traditional Emirati version of the spice tea. Oh, wow. <laughs> so Emirati chai, basically. Exactly. Right? Emirati spice chai. <laughs> Rosena, what is that? This is a green machine. <laughs> this is not Emirati. <laughs> it's like a green smoothie. And uh, this is the shawabs. It's also with the saffron. It's their oh. version of the pancake. Okay, and here we are. We got the full on Emirati breakfast. Yes. yes. <laughs> Looks <laughs> awesome. <laughs> so we just start with this one? What do you think? We yeah, can, you can it. start light or with this. Let's start with the lamb. Let's start with the lamb. We're hungry. Let's start the Let's start. Let's start. Let's, start. <laughs> Let's go. Ooh, crispy parata. Ooh. It reminds me of the one in, in Chennai. Yeah. Oh, it yeah, thick. thick. That is fluffy, still flaking, lots of layers. Yeah, lots right? of layers and very heavy. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh, it smells amazing. <laughs> oh. And then just go right in. Just yeah. go right in. Ooh. Take that soft lamb, see how it's. Ooh, mm -hmm. it's still so hot. Oh, still so hot. Wow. Potatoes. There's nothing better than lamb gravies, lamb stews, lamb curries <laughs> with tomato. Lamb everything. Potato, everything with lamb. Lamb is the best. <laughs> Should we try it out? Let's try it. Mmm. 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 Mm. Oh. Mm. It's like a rich lamb stew. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like exactly. super hearty. Yeah. Mmm. It's very aromatic and very light, mm -hmm. although it's lamb. That's why they serve it for breakfast. Oh, wow. Yeah, aromatic, tomatoey. Very, very breakfast kind of dish, right? Yeah, mm -hmm. it's like the tomato the aroma. Mm. Almost like you could eat that with noodles. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, you can. Got it. <laughs> Comes in this like little taba, right? Mm. You can go for another bite of that too. Yeah. It's really I good. Mean, I'm too hungry. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Is that nice, eh? Mmm. It's so delicious. Lamb is my favorite meat. Is it? Mm hmm. Oh, mm -hmm. especially. <laughs> yeah. Especially here, right? Mm hmm. Yeah, especially in the Middle East. It's the best. So. This is the star right here for sure. Mm. Wow. That's good energy for all day. Mm hmm. Yeah, nice filling meal, right? Mm -hmm. If you just have this, that's it. And we have karati. Cheers. Cheers, Cheers guys. guys. Cheers. Mmm. <laughs> mm. Mm. Oh yeah, still piping hot, right? Yeah. So good. Mm -hmm. It goes down well with the lamb and the. Yeah. Oh yeah. Mm. Great pairing right there. Okay, so next up, maybe we should try this fancy, uh, like amazing, 
saffron pancake, right? Yes, it's mm -hmm. their version of the pancake. It's with a lot of saffron. See the inside? Oh, it's like aerated. Yeah. Oh, wow. It's like, uh, yeah, totally it's fluffy, very, very aerated. Bubbly. You can smell the saffron, mm -hmm. maybe a little cinnamon, yes. cardamom. Cardamom. Right. Mm-hmm. 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 Cardamom. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. You gotta dip it in the Saffron. yogurt. Saffron. Oh, you dip it in the yogurt? Yeah, you can dip it in yogurt. Okay. You can, they have the pineapple jam. Mm. All right. Mm. The melon, melon and pineapple. So it's much cool. saffron. Yeah, so this is like a cream cheese and yogurt mix. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you can taste the melon. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. So this is a melon jam, huh? I thought yeah. it was honey for a second, but wow. No, it's melon. Mmm. Mm. So good. So good with that saffron. Mm hmm. The melon. It's like infused into it. Cardamom. Love it. That's a nice pancake. Mm hmm. You can actually mix it with the cheese and the melon. Okay. That's how they yeah. Although not much of tomatoes, it's really, oh, really good. Oh, it's a nice omelet, huh? Yep. With the chili in there. Mmm, the chili. Parsley. Parsley. Oh. David's been looking forward for this chili. <laughs> <laughs> and you took it. No, I'm going to give it to you. Oh, okay. Try it together. Yeah. She made like a little taco, right? A little yes. pocket here. A little taco, mm. yeah. <laughs> nice. With a chili. Cheers. I should get a chili in mine too. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Oh yeah, there's a chili, there's a chili. Just tomato on it, right? Yes, yeah, yeah, okay, tomato okay. and egg. Cheers, guys. Mm. 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 Oh! Wow. Mm. It's nice. Oh, it's a chili. Nice spice. Mm -hmm. That's nice, there's some spice in there. Mm -hmm. mm. And this is... What sort of bread is this? Yeah, it is their version of the, like a naan, but it's their version of the roti. It's a flat bread. So Rosanna's gonna make us the ultimate bite. She's gonna mix basically everything yeah. yes. in one. In one. Break it into two. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's how they eat it here. They always mix and match their breakfast. Okay. So mm. they put a little bit of everything. This is just an amazing breakfast. I love that because I love mixing things. Yeah. yeah. I'm all about it. You know, different textures, flavors. Yeah. So that's a fava bean? Chickpeas? Yes. yes. It's amazing. Okay. Yeah. So with the egg, <laughs> the bread, and then that's like a pickled salad, right? Yeah. Mm. So this is just with mustard in there. Yeah. A lot mm. of mustard, a little bit of lime juice and onions. Wow, luxury. Look at all the ingredients in there. Yeah. Wow. So, David. What a bite. Luxury. <laughs> Thanks, Rosanna. Ooh. <laughs> and you gained a small bite. <laughs> yeah, because I already had. I know. See, we have a long day of eating, so you have to pace ourselves, right? Those uh, baba beans are giant. I know, they're massive, right? Try it out. Let's try Let's it. Try it out, guys. Yeah. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> mm. Whoa. Nice burst, huh? Oh. Mmm. So healthy. Super healthy. I love the bean, huh? Mm. Yeah. So that's really refreshing. And this is, um, so this one right here is a sweet, Noodles. Sweet noodles yeah. with egg, right? You can put it up on that. Yeah, just like that? <laughs> wow, look at that. They do mix with, the noodles yeah, with egg? Yeah, with the savory egg. Because this is sweet. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm. It's the, mustard flavor in here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's very subtle, aromatic flavors, but mm -hmm. packed with protein. Mm. See, it's all like protein, protein, mm. protein. Mm, I love this. Huge baba beans. My brother and <laughs> from northern Spain, they have like ba uh, baba soup. Oh, cool right. this, yeah. Mm. Mm. That's good. Nice breakfast. Very nice. <laughs> it's amazing. It hits the spot. Mm. Mm. I think for sure the lamb was the best, but this yeah. is really nice. Mm. Never had noodles this sweet. Yeah, sweet noodles. First time. Mm -hmm. Very nice. We're going deep street style. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Be good. I think lots of Indian street food today, right, Regina? Yeah, yeah. Lots of Indian deep street style food. Thank you so much. Oh. Bye. Amazing Emirati breakfast. So good. Nice mix of flavors, textures. Oh, it was fantastic. Personally, I love the lamb. And as you can see right here, as you enter El Fanar, you have like the camel and Emirati, right? And then they also have a blue Land Rover, right? Yeah, beautiful car. Incredible. And now we're gonna go for some more food. Let's go. To be honest, I ate a lot. Did you? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I ate a bit too. Yeah. We needed it though. We were hungry. Yeah. We, we were hungry. We fasted a lot, right? Yeah, we didn't eat much and now we're ready for a full day of eating. Yeah, so we just passed like the entire, I guess, business district, lots of brand new buildings. And in here, it's like fortress over here, right? So like really old school area. Yeah, it's beautiful. Lots of stuff up here. I think the restaurant's just right up here. So we just parked and we're walking over to a biryani yeah, spot. Yeah, local joint. Rosanna's selection, it should be really good. Everything she chooses is always good. Yeah? Yeah. Here in Rola, 
So this is one of the places that you have to stop for the biryani. What type of biryani? So it's like a Kerala style biryani. Oh, beef biryani oh. Is awesome. Kerala oh. style beef biryani. Yes. Malabar, love it. Oh, it's right here. <laughs> hey, how you yeah, doing? How are you? Hi. Good? Hey, pleasure, man. Nice Meeting a long you. time. Hi, how are you? A lot of stuff, but their biryani is really, really famous, and they're already really busy doing like takeaways. So, how many a day do you sell here? On seven hundred. This is a Malabar biryani. It's from Calicut, like yeah, around there. I mean, yeah. I've been there. I've been there. Oh, really? Yeah, man. All the way to Kasaragod. Kasaragod, yeah. Kasaragod. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's still the Malabar. It's okay. All right, guys, we're going into the kitchen to see the biryani. <laughs> it's all biryani? Over there, there is biryani oh, and oh, all packs. So, is it all the same biryani? Same thing? No, uh, no, we have four meats, which is uh, mutton, beef, chicken, and we have the village chicken, known as a lagoon chicken. Village chicken? Yeah, mm. that's more uh, stronger than the broiler chicken. Oh, okay. So, we may use the all fresh meats, except the broiler chicken, which comes in. Uh, and which, which one is the wedding biryani? Or they're all wedding biryani? It's all prepared in the style of that wedding biryani. Oh, okay. The most simple, very simple biryani. Simple? Yeah. No turbos, no charges, nothing. It's simple masala. That's why you keep it and we keep the best ingredients. Perfect. Amazing. So this is like traditional dumb biryani. What does that mean? Well, they make them in these vats. They seal them, right? You seal yeah, them yeah, we do and seal you them. cover it. Like yeah, it's colored. Top. Yeah. And we keep it for like 15, 20 minutes. Dumb is like, you know, we have the masalas and the meat in it and the down of this uh, pot. Mm -hmm. And when you put the dum, the whole flavor comes out. So that's why we keep the holes here. The hole brings the aroma out. Do normally like this. Oh, so the okay. good stuff is on the bottom, right? Yeah, the, the color changes. It's always on the bottom, right? Yeah. Changes the color of the whole biryani. It looks amazing. Yeah. For our specialty is we don't use any color or any uh, special taste enhancers or nothing like that. What do you recommend? The chicken or the... the you have to meat? eat all. Beef no, is our all. top. All. <laughs> eat it all. <laughs> we make the fresh chicken uh, without frying and make it dumb. This is oh, how it looks tender. It's good. What's the name of the rice? This is the same rice. No, we use the, the same. Uh, this is the jeera gashala or kaima. Kaima rice. Yeah. Is it spicy or is it more aromatic? More aromatic. So you know that Indian people like spicy, right? Yeah. So we need to be a, not very spicy, but it should be spicy. Have, a some, have some kick to it. Yeah. A bit of... Uh, just a little bit. Just oh, like oh yes. look at that. How with the plate looks is. Good, it looks good, doesn't it? looks so good. So this is the beef one, right? Yeah, the beef one. Yeah, I love how you just cover it. Oh, yeah. right? That's how it is. Kerala style, just like that. Might be seen a yellow color biryani. No color. Yeah, natural. natural. Kerala is such a beautiful place. Like, so green. Yeah. Fresh it's a lot. Delicious food. Less people. Yeah, friendly Less people. Less people? Le le I mean, 30 million people compared to Delhi, 30 million, you know? Wow. It's all about the mixing skills. Yes. It has to be perfectly mixed because if you don't get the right amount of masala, if you don't get that perfect ratio, yeah. the whole plate of biryani, is you might not enjoy useless. it, right? Yeah. Exactly. And then you won't come back. They always put out the meat first and then they cover it with rice. So if you ever see a biryani that's done on a pan, that's more like a fried rice. Yeah, yeah. All right, guys, it is time to eat this incredible biryani. We're trying three different ones, mutton, beef, and chicken. Type of pickle. This is a dates, beetroot. This is also served in this uh, marriage type in the Malabar style. You put and, uh, it on the biryani? Yeah, we put it a little. It's a touch. A little bit, okay. Yeah. Malabar style. They always put the right side like on it, right? Yeah, so you make it very creamy it. and then it, like, it's like a paste. And then it's oh, all yeah. all together. Maybe somebody will just uh, touch with the finger. This is maybe somebody will mix with the rice. This is the papada. Maybe you know very yeah, well. Yeah, papada is good. And you can just crack it over the yeah. biryani. Look at all these biryanis. Beautiful. Wow. And I love the way you packed it. It's like perfectly round, mm -hmm. like a like a like an orb. Yeah. Let's go in. And this is a prize. We don't even know which is which yeah. at this point. Let's go in. Oh, oh the masala in the middle. Oh, nice and hot. I think I got beef. I got yeah, the chicken. The biryani. Oh, I got the mutton. Look at that. Mutton. Mm. Oh. So oh, break wow. it up. Oh, nice bone here. Wow, the rice. You can feel it. It's just soaked in. Mm -hmm. All of it's the nice juices and moist. from the meat. Yep. So beef, chicken, and mutton biryani. Let's try it out, guys. Let's try it out. Wedding biryani. Let's do Cheers. it. Cheers. Mmm. 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 Oh. Mmm. Like teleports me back to Kerala. Mmm. Wow. Whoa. That meat is so tender. Mmm. It just melts. You don't need your teeth. It's just. Wow. You don't need your teeth. It's that smooth. That's really nice. Very, is it very spicy like the... Uh, no, it's spicy. It's smooth. Yeah. Aromatic. 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 And now we just put some of this on the side, right? Mm-hmm. Want some? I put it right on there. Right on there, Yeah, right? thanks, buddy. There you go. 
Yeah. One, two. Little, 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 little. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> it's, like it's like using a wasabi now. <laughs> oh, oh, give me a lot, give me a lot. Okay, wait, I like wasabi. You gotta try it, you gotta try it. I like the try, 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 try. Yeah, you gotta try it, you gotta try it. Uh, so, this is the <laughs> so it sounds like this is the extreme pickle. Yeah. yeah. So it looks like a plum jam. Yeah, but it's, right? it's made with beef. Beef root and dates. Oh, beef and dates, okay. Yeah, that sounds spicy neat. like other ones. Okay. It's, it's not spicy. Uh, we'll see. Try it. <laughs> try it. Mmm. 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 No. Mmm. You can definitely tell it's sweet from the date. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah. A little sour, but not too sour. Yeah. It adds a freshness exactly. to the onion. But it blends in well with the rice yeah. and it pops out all the flavors. Mm. Incredible. Wow. It's really popping, right? Mm. The it's flavors not, are popping it's not out. too yeah. strong. Not too strong. You can add a lot of that. Yeah. yeah. Mm. I wouldn't say wasabi, I'd say a little lighter than that. Yes. Never ending biryani. Wow. So good. Mm -hmm. That's really flavorful. Mm -hmm. and very, very homely. Can mm. you feel the taste? Homely, very homely. homely. Mm -hmm. homely. It's not, not exactly street style flavor. Mm. 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 Wow. So authentic though. Mm. A lot of Ker Kerala here, right? In uh, UAE. Yeah. Kerala's. And mm. I love Kerala cuisine. Oh, me too. Crack a papara on here, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Crack a papara. Crack a papara. Yeah, so next time you crack a papara, just grab one like this. Let's go right here. You gotta, yeah, salt in there. Salt like salve. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Guys, uh, uh, you can. All right, now my turn to eat the beef. No, I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> oh, it's gonna have a little piece right there. Oh, it's really good. Oh yeah, right there. Mmm. Mmm. Is the best? Is, is that the best? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, I got lucky. No, yes. No. Beef is the best here. Oh, I got lucky. You know, it's all yum, but that's the That's the best. That's yeah, the I mean, in Kerala, it's all about the beef, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So good. This I got the mud and bone, and you got the marrow right here. You suck. Oh, you got a. Oh! Oh, it came out there! Oh my gosh. Wow, that's a rare, like. Yeah, yeah. Fatty meat. That's a delicacy right yeah, here. Yeah, that's a Can I find another bone anywhere? Yeah. No, no, no other bone. Ah, a lot of bone marrow in there. <laughs> wow, nice bite there, David. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. I mean, we have a two-hour break, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> we have a two-hour break. Oh, yeah, there it is. Look at that pickle. Look at that pickle. That's what it's all about right there. It just pops. Mm. 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 The marriage biryani. So we got the chicken. It's still really hot. It weighs a lot. It's really hot, heavy. Ooh. There's the beef, the mutton, and then you got the village chicken as well. Yeah, the lagoon chicken. Wow. Ooh. Let's try it out. Let's, Let's try, try it, it out. Try it. Oh, oh, it's heavy. Oh, it's heavy. Wow. Right, you know what? I'm taking it home. <laughs> With pineapple, mint, and lime. Lemon. You know, in India they have like this masala water basically. Yeah. It's similar, right? It's not masala. It's purely the juices. Oh, so no masala. No, no masala. Mm, no nice juices. Yeah. Pineapple here too? Yeah, the pineapple and the mint and lime. So you can order pineapple chunks as, as well with the basil seeds. Mm. Very nice, refreshing. Mm, love it. Nice way to clean my palate. All right, thank you so much, my friend. Hope you enjoyed it. Amazing Malabar biryani. The pickle. The pickle? Pickle made it. Homemade. <laughs> we owe you. No. That was a pleasure, you know. I really want you guys to have and try. That's it. How much do we owe you? No? Just uh, uh, low and uh, lights. That's it. <laughs> and now you're nice and busy. Yeah, it's going to be a little more packed, maybe. Alright okay, guys, thank you so much, appreciate it. Enjoy everybody. Shukriya, shukriya. Let's go. My man, thank you so much. Hope thank you enjoyed you. it. Appreciate nice meeting it. you, pleasure. Awesome. Very really nice from all the way from Miami. Now you guys know, the best the Dumb Biryani, Malabar style Dumb Biryani in the UAE is right here in Sharjah and he's opening up. Mafil Biryani. Yes, yes. Thank you. Thank Wedding you. style. Ready? Let's go! Let's More go. food all day! I need a break! <laughs> Where are we going next? We're going Juice World! Juice Having a, a juice break. Let's go inside. So I'm going with oh, the pomegranate juice. What are you going to get? Oh, Faluda! Faluda! I'll just take a Faluda. And a water. <laughs> <laughs> I can't because the Faluda gets me too full, you know? <laughs> it's so cute! Dude. I got the cutest Faluda, look at that! <laughs> look at that! Mmm. Mmm. Got some pomegranate juice. Mm. Oh, I need that refreshing, huh? Yeah. So hot outside. It's perfect. What'd you get? I got like a lemon drop. Just lemon juice, ice, just a lemon shake. 
I got a lychee shake. Very manly, huh? Very manly. It goes down. But here... Trevor, what did they bring you? They brought extra, like, nice items. It looks beautiful. Oh, oh my god. This is a... So this is three faludas? Okay. Oh, looking okay, good. Okay, okay. Nice. That's how it is? <laughs> wow, it's awesome. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Looking good. When you go around with the food ranger, everything's comped. <laughs> <laughs> this just nutty mix of ice cream, fruits. I'll try this one. Mmm. How's that? Mmm, delicious. It's good. Mm hmm. Crunchy and sweet. Obviously, ice cream. It's nice good. and fruity. Yeah. That's oh, fantastic. I love it. Mm. This is how it is. Usually in India, though, just mix everything, right? Mm hmm. Mmm. Mmm. Worth it. Mmm, the crunchiness. Mm-hmm. Let's try the bite. Mmm, mango. Mango? Mmm. <laughs> you enjoying that one, huh? Mmm. Super good. Yeah, the second one is a mix of mango, you got nuts, really refreshing. What else is in here, Ting? It's like rice puffs. Right? Rice puffs, right? Mm. Yeah, exactly. Oh, they got rice puffs. Yeah. Mmm. That's super Mmm. That's the one. It literally feels like I'm in India. You know, all the juices, the faluda, all the crunchiness. It's awesome. And here, as you can see, all the fruit hanging, all fake fruit, obviously. Or actually, it's not fake. This is real fruit. They just put it up here like that <laughs> with tape. Amazing. And yeah, great spot to come, you know, especially when it's hot outside. Right now, it's 2 p.m., super hot. I'm just having some pomegranate juice to freshen up. Oh, I'm super tired. Still jet lag after three days. So we're going to eat some Yemen food. Yes. Man. Mandi. Mandi. So it's like a rice dish. Yep. Right? It's a rice dish. It's cooked in the stock. Okay. But here the speciality is you get the salmon mandi. Salmon mandi. Amazing. Yeah. yeah. I'm excited. I haven't had salmon in a while, so it's going to be gonna good. It's going to be good. <laughs> and it's the restaurant Beit Al Mandi. So uh, Yemenite food. How are you doing? Good? Yeah, yeah. Nice mandi. Good mandi? Yeah, good mandi. Oh. They've got all kinds of meats and kebabs and they've got the fish. So these are all the platters, right? Yeah, oh, so we got the barbecue mutton. The different mutton platters? Yes, it's very hard to get it here in UAE. So Sharjah is one of the spots that people come to all around from UAE to eat the salmon mandi. Oh, it's basically a delicacy here in Sharjah. Yes, it's a delicacy here in Sharjah. Wow, amazing. <laughs> they do a lot of mutton, chicken, fish. One camel kapsa. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, and what's this? Is this? So this is the lamb stock. They boil the lamb in this and then they take the lamb out to be cooked or grilled. But they offer the soup to pour it on top of the rice. Oh, wow. I'm half asleep, so I need some Arabic coffee. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's good. Aroma. Mmm, that's potent. You know, when you travel from America to the UAE, it's a 14-hour flight, so you need literally, well, you need an hour or a day per hour change. Yeah. I so I need this. <laughs> Nice, right? Strong. Mmm. Mm. Yes, this is what I love. It's gonna them. wake you up. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Super strong. It's so different, right? The Arabic coffee? Yes, it's very aromatic mm -hmm. and subtle, but gives you a good punch. Yeah, yeah. Just one shot, right? One shot. Oh, I'm awake now. Yes. It's kunafe. It's a dessert. We made with fried vermicelli and they put cream or cheese in the middle and they put sugar syrup on top. Mm. You can put pistachio, rose, rose essence. It's really lovely. We got access to go in the kitchen. We're going to see how they plate this mandy. Whoa, look at this! Wow! Giant mandy. Wow, so this is the special. The grilled chicken, the grilled fish, lamb, salmon. Wow, it's just giant. Yeah. Giant look portions. At the, look at the pot that they are making. It's huge. It's, it's like a insane. giant pot. It's a oh giant platter of rice. Yeah. Beautiful. We want to have raisins. What else do we have in yeah, here? Yeah, what do we got in here? We've got spices in there like cinnamon, cassia, onions, garlic, and raisins. Oh, and saffron. You can see the yeah, saffron. Yeah, yeah, yeah. saffron. Yeah. yeah. Saffron. Yeah. Wrapped, is this a banana leaf? Yeah, banana leaf and. Uh, and then some mutton and uh, potato. Let them spicy this one. Oh, spicy. Stop. And then this is mutton mat food, right? This mutton mat food. Mutton mat food. Mutton mat food. Yes. Mat food. yes. <laughs> so, what's the difference? Spicy. Oh, spicy. Spicy okay. and then just uh, turmeric, right? It's a special order. That's why they have everything. So they have the mud spoon, the, the, no, the normal mandi, and then the raisins and the, the cashew nuts, almonds. It's like a special platter. This is kapsa rice, this is mahout rice. Local Emirati, yeah. Arabic all spices. All of Emirati, all of uh, Arabian. Amazing. Thank, yes, you. thank you. You're welcome. Thank, thank you. you. You're welcome. Look at the chicken. Wow. 
Does it all take away? It's popping with color. Right here they have the chicken mandy and the reason it's so rare is because they added saffron and inside here there's like a million chicken. Chicken on rice. That's basically it, right? It's crazy in here. It's so amazing. I know. Honey's jam. Honey's yeah, jam. So they put a lot of turmeric in their saffron and then their own little marination. They have their own spices and they grill it. Oh. Special platter. Wow, so four types of Arabic rice here. Oh, wow. four types. Look at this. That's the whole lamb. Huh? Don't touch this one. Oh, I won't. Don't, don't want to lose my skin today. <laughs> that crunch. Wow. That's super good. Guys, this is what I want to eat. <laughs> this lamb. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Look at how tender it looks. It's so jiggly. Look at the jiggle. Look at the jiggle. Oh. The ribs, man, that's the best part. It's super hot. Oh, look at the it's scorching. Oh, this is the head. Yeah, oh, the head, the head. Oh, yeah, thank you so much. You're welcome. It's raining. Yes. Raining with goodness. The bum is the best part here. <laughs> it's so packed. People love the food here. Oh, the food. Yeah. I mean, this platter is just insane. Oh, and then chili. Chilies yes. too? So we're going to get a platter, but maybe not quite that we big. We can't finish that. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> Yeah, we're not getting a platter this big. This is just huge. This is for a family right yeah, here. Right? A big family party. Yeah. Nice Chikria, to meet you. Chikria. Nice Guys. to meet you. Thank okay. you. Let's go eat, let's man. Let's go, let's go. Let's go eat. Cannot wait to eat right now. Looking good. Salmon. So what do we got? Oh, here's the special salmon. Yes. yes. The Arabic spice. This right here? This is the camel meat. Matan. Camel meat. Camel mani. Oh, I love it. Last time I had that was in Pakistan. Yeah. All right, we are ready. Oh, well, here we are. So we got the full on Salmon with the Bukhara rice? Yeah, Bukhari mm -hmm. rice. And then the camel Mandi. with the Mandi rice. Yes. Amazing. A bunch of chilies and the salsa. What was the salsa called? Shata. 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 Look at that. Shata. So how do we do it? So we can, we have to first put the onions on top. Onions on top? Oh, onions on top. Wow. All over. And this is blackened salmon with the Arabic spices, right? Yes, it's the Arabic spices. So the rice has like cinnamon, cardamom, uh, white pepper, Arabic spices. And this is more milder version. Milder that, version. Milder version. There's onions, tomato, the, all the lamb stock. Stock is actually in the rice. Yes. Yes, that's wow. Great. Oh, you're gonna dump the, dump the chilies? Yeah, so we're gonna like un oh, dump oh my God. the chili. <laughs> so with every bite, you can like have a chili? Let me get one. Okay. <laughs> oh, <laughs> mm, not so bad. Not so bad? It's, it's so bad. gonna come. It's, it's gonna, gonna come. You think so? <laughs> okay. I hope not. And then this is the lamb stock, right? Yeah, so you oh, can wow. add the lamb stock. Ooh, into the? Into the rice. Into the rice. Yeah. You can add a little of the shatta. The so salsa. Can, wow. So each bite gets Oh wow. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Oh wow. Oh, wow, this is so colorful now. Yep. It's a mix, right? Yeah. Should salmon. we go for the salmon? Yeah, I think so. Salmon, salmon first. Salmon okay. first, right? Look at that blackened salmon. Yes, it's all the Arabic Ooh. spices. Just gonna break Real. it up. Oh, it's, oh. Look at that. Oh. Blackened oh. Arabic <laughs> spices. Oh, it's tender. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And oh. moist. I love this piece right here. Oh, oh look at the black. Just gonna mix it into that oh, rice, right? Just get it with yeah. the yogurt and the Arabic salsa. Wow. Let's try it out, guys. Let's try it. It's good, right? Mm. Wow! <laughs> so nice. That is so tender. Mm -hmm. Super tender. Mm. Love the blackened part, right? And the the blackened aroma. aroma. Mm -hmm. The aroma. The aroma, the rice. The, the blackened aroma. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm. It's super, like super yeah. moist, right? It's so good. Oh, it's just grilled to perfection. Mm. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Tendery with a little bit of citrus from mm -hmm. the lemon that thing squeezed on there. Yeah. Exactly. Oh, it's mm. so good. So easy to eat, right? What I love about salmon, mm. it's not too like salty or fishy. Yeah. That's seriously delicious. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. So That's some of the best salmon you'll ever eat right there. Mm -hmm. mm. Wow. That's why it's a delicacy here. Yeah. Okay, man, I'm enjoying that the salmon. That salmon is so addictive. It's super addictive. So tender, so moist. Mm -hmm. It's really good. That's how you're it? supposed to do it, right? Yep. Like that. Oh yeah, you got the skills, man. Do we break up a little bit of chili? Something in here? Maybe some of that? You got the real skills. Yeah. Mix it all in. Just gotta make it like that, right? Can I pour a little salsa yeah, on there? Yeah, do can, it. You can pour as much as you like. That's the flavor right there. Look mm -hmm. at that. Oh, oh so satisfying. That pour fresh salsa, salsa flavor. Mm. <laughs> it's good, isn't it? It's so good. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The yogurt. 
And then one bite of chili just to give that kick. Yeah. Fun. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Oh. Mm. Oh, that's a. Not too bad. Not too bad. Fresh. Good. Mm hmm. Fresh chili. Fresh chili. Fresh aroma. I'm sure it's like one in ten. It's like really spicy. Yeah. Right? Jolly camel. Same thing applies. Okay. Let's oh. Put a little soup in there. Okay. Oh. We're gonna try the camel. Let's try the camel. With yeah, yeah. mandi rice. With mandi rice. Okay. Oh, this is a little bit lighter rice, right? Mm hmm. Look the camel meat. The color just breaks up, huh? Yeah. Because the camel meat is very strong in flavor. Whoa. It's stronger in flavor. Yes. Look at the fat. Oh, yeah, yeah. jiggly. It's like a little more gamey, right? Oh, you got the fat? Yeah. That's the hump, maybe. <laughs> 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 that might be the hump there. Yeah. The hump. Only few places that serve the salmon, but this place is the best place for me so far in UAE. Wow. The entire wow. UAE. Amazing. Well, thank you for bringing us yes, here. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. You're welcome. Amazing food. Yeah, incredible. And obviously, we have more bread. We have kebabs there. So, what did they bring us there? It's a mix. Like a special mixed grill platter. I love yeah. the camel. You love the camel? Mm hmm. It's very, very heavy, right? There's like no spices on it. It's almost the same as salmon, how it breaks apart. Yeah. Right? Yeah. It's so well because usually it's a little bit more tougher. Okay. But they cook it really well here. The salmon is awesome. Yeah. They're both great. awesome though. The spices in there are just awesome. Mm. Good, eh? Good. Mm hmm You like the camo or the salmon? Salmon better. Salmon? Mm -hmm. But both really good, eh? Mm hmm A world over, they have like a grilled piece of salmon with vegetables and the salmon is always with salt and pepper mm. and not much going on. Got it. Yeah. Or juicy. Super juicy, right? Mmm. How true? How true? Shishi, eh? Love the camel. Love the camel meat. Salmon for me is. Not that good. Mmm. 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 There's a lot of Baitel Mandi places. That's why I got confused. You have to come to the Baitel Mandi Yemenite one. Ting and I are going ham here with the kebabs. Mm. But this one, this is like the fat of the lamb. So juicy. Mmm. Mm -hmm. This one here. Mm. This one nice? Yeah, yeah, that one's nice. Mm. Oh, everything is good. Chili monster. Chili monster, you're eating all the chilies? Yeah. <laughs> so good. But you like spice, right? Mm. No, we pay, we pay, we pay. Pay, pay, pay. No, pay. No, no, no. No? Oh, it was a big meal. It was a big so where are we going next? We're gonna be doing one of your favorites. Uh oh. Yeah. It's a surprise. We'll see. <laughs> Okay, after about a five minute drive, we're here at Bombay Suites and we're gonna have some Pani Foodi. Let's go! So this place has been open for more than 10 years and it's well known in this area for to be one of the best places. So besides Pani Foodi, they also have Halwa, they have Jalabi, they probably have Ladu. You have Ladu, Rasgula, Gulab Jamun, everything. Mysore packs, so a lot of like rice cakes slash, you know, super sugary. Get with ghee and milk powder. Put all the spices that. and it's really, really Looks nice. good. <laughs> Hi, boss. We have the Pani Puri station. So as you can see, they have all these different chats. Over here, they have Pada Pao, Pa Budgi. And right here, my friend, Pani Puri. Your record was 48. 48. 48 Pani Puri. I had 48, well, Fuchka, which is Bengali style, but similar. All right, so he's making some for customers, right? So what he does is he cracks a hole in the puri. Yeah. Fills it up with chickpeas. Yeah, the chickpea. And then loads the chickpea with some coriander and some mint chutney. Exactly. I think I saw a tamarind chutney in there too, right? For sure. Oh, wow. Looks so good. it's like sweet yeah. and a little spicy and a little sour. Exactly. All right, let's so go have some. Let's eat. Usually they put a dry potato filling, but here it's very, very saturated and a beautiful, thick gravy-like filling. So it's very different and different feel and taste. Give me one already. Oh my God, Kanda. How was that? Mm. It's a nice burst. burst. So after having a few pani puris, they usually give you a dry one, right? And that's what she's having here. <laughs> I cannot wait. It's like the Ooh. it's like the pani puri station. You can just like exactly. pop them down. So we should load up amaranth chutney, right? Oh yeah, make some little sweet. Just dunk it straight in. Just yeah. dunk it in. Okay, okay. drown it. I'm gonna try. Yeah, drown. Just drown it. Oh, look at that. Yeah. <laughs> be careful. Yeah, be careful. You don't want it to burst. Yeah, it gets soggy if not. Oh, thank you so much. Perfect. So you sweet. had 48 one time. 48 one time after a meal. After a meal. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Mmm. 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 Oh wow. With everything, right? It's cooling. 
Mm -hmm. Yeah, a little spicy, a little sweet. Nice crunch. I, I like that chickpea gravy. It's yeah. a little different. Yeah. And it's, it's different. Yeah, it's not like like aloo yeah. and yeah. Oh, exactly. it's addictive. Mm -hmm. And the oh. puri is so crunchy. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'll have like a million of these. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Oh, mm -hmm. the juice. Mmm. <laughs> so good. So good. So much flavor. I know. Ross? Yeah, yeah, the puri. Oh my god. Yeah, so it's, it's with yogurt. Same but with yogurt, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah it's oh, way more know, loaded. There's tomato, there's the coriander, it's more... Sev, right? Sev, so yeah. Sev right there. We have coriander. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, if I can even That's find the, it. That's the tahi version. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. yeah, this is way more filling. Way more. Mmm! Mmm! It's like nice and chilled, right? Cold. Mm. The potato in there. Mm -hmm. Nothing better. Mm -hmm. It's like chat style, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. So you get a whole plate of that, right? Mm. Yeah. So sweet. And it's good here, right? Mm -hmm. What do you think? I think it's awesome. It's yeah. different, right? Yeah. I think that the filling is what makes it, right? The that mashed, is very different. mashed potato. Yeah. Mm -hmm. With all the sauces. Oh, mm. amazing. Really nice. <laughs> All right, my friends, I don't think we ate enough pani puri, so we're gonna have one more each. Yeah. You ready? Here it is, look at those beauties. Look at this. Wow. Nothing like a good pani puri. One of the best street snacks from India. Dude, it's the best. Seriously, the best. For me, it's the ultimate. Yeah, the ultimate. Here we go. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. The pani. The masala. So many flavors in there. Mm-hmm. Sweet, sour, spicy, crunchy, Everything. different textures. <laughs> mm. Nothing like it. All right, let's go. What are we doing next? Luxury dosa? <laughs> let's go. <laughs> let's go. Thank you. See you guys. Shukriya. Rosina, where are we going next? We're gonna go for a surprise dosa place. What? Surprise, it'd be good. <laughs> yeah. I love dosas, Indian crepes, so good. After a 10 minute drive, we're here at TR Cafe. We're gonna have a dosa with beef. Special dosa, it looks amazing. Let's go check it out, guys. Let's go. Hi, hey, sir. how you doing? Everything good? Good evening, sir. This is a spot, right? Oh, so, it's a cozy little spot. Three tables, it's amazing. There's a hidden little gem here. All right, guys. Yeah. So we're going to the kitchen to see how they make the beef dosa. Hey, how you doing? So right now, he's making the masala for the dosa, the beef masala, so it's onion, tomato, chili. I'm sure it's gonna be ground beef, and then over here, I think we're gonna witness a very unique masala making for the dosa. The wok is on. Look at this. Wow, oh, that aroma. Oh, Nothing and then the like tomato it. goes in. Mm -hmm. Cabate. It's like a little stir fry. Oh man, the aroma's here. It literally takes me back to Kerala. You got the curry leaves, the coconut oil. So many masalas just coming together with that high heat right now. <laughs> Pressure cooked in that stock so that the beef will be nice and soft and then they're gonna put it into that oh, masala. And chopping it up? Yep. Into the wok. So after he mixed the beef in there, he threw in like a curry and it makes it a little thicker, right? Thicker gravy. So it's like a beef curry leaf. Yeah, so many aromas mixing in there. Yeah. All the curry leaves, the masalas, the cumin. Wow. wow. All going into a dosa. Yeah, into a dosa. Okay, we have a dosa batter, so that's made with lentil and rice. Yeah, yes. fermented, and look at the. I know. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's so good. It's gonna go on this beautiful. Only way to make it, right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Real magic is this beef. Oh, what's this? Beef. Morgi. Morgi. Crispy. I love it. It's super crispy. This one. It's almost like a paper dosa. Good. Sounds amazing. Oh, sambar. Yes. yes. Sambar. Coconut chutney, Coconut. tomato chutney. After a few thousand dosas. <laughs> I'm excited, we're having a dosa at five at night, six yeah, at night. Let's do it. Hey, dosa anytime, right? Anytime, anytime of day. So right here, is the, beef dosa. No, the beef dosa, yeah, that's a beef oh, dosa. Oh, beef in yeah. here, beef in here? Yeah. yeah, beef in here. I love all the chutneys. Yeah, the chutneys, it's always with chutneys, right? Always with sambar. Yeah. Yeah. And then you, what you should do is you should grab a piece and then open this oh, yeah. and pour it out, let's right? Let's take a look, let's take yeah, a look. Yeah, so like, just like that. Let's take if a look. I can get in there. Look at that. Oh. Masala. It's almost like a beef roast, right? Oh, yeah. it's scorching oh. hot. So you're supposed to get this, right? Go yeah. like that. Oh man, oh man, I'm getting hungry now. Let me get in there. Let me get in go, there. Go, go, go. <laughs> this is so hot. I gotta eat it fast because it's, oh, it's like boiling. Let's go. Mm. Mm. How is that? Mm. Mm. Oh, what are you saying? Did you eat with chutney? Yeah, with coconut. Oh, coconut. Always. Oh, never go wrong with coconut chutney. Oh, dude, always. So good. It's the best one. Oh, it's so hot. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, those oh, yeah. is the one thing you have to eat right on the spot. Oh, yeah. way. There it is. Look at that. A little dip in the coconut chutney. Yeah. I'm going for the tomato. Oh. Going for the tomato? I'll go for the tomato too. Yeah. That, the, the, the aroma coming from all the spices in there, mm -hmm. yeah. in particular the curry leaves. Yes. Exactly. It's just so, so aromatic. My mouth is Let's try it out, guys. Let's try it out, guys. 
Did I tell you? <laughs> yeah, that was it. Seriously, one of the best sauces you'll ever eat. I think so. Yeah. yeah. And it like literally, like if you've never been to Kerala, this would yeah. just teleport you there. Yeah. yeah. You don't have to go to Kerala. Just come here. The exactly. Kerala aroma. Straight up. Yeah, man. Oh. The curry leaves, the coconut oil. Mm. I know. Thank you guys. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Amazing. Mm -hmm. The masala's in that beef. Wow. It's like tropical. I know. Mm -hmm. It's tropical masala. Like if you're a meat lover exactly. and, and Indian vegetarian dosa lover, mm -hmm. this is like the perfect marriage. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> you're right. I really think this is one of the best dosa I've ever had. Oh wow. Straight up. I think just that that beef, you know, I guess exactly. beef, roast, masala, with the curry leaves, the coconut, the all the natural ingredients. And the crunchy dosa. Yeah. Crunchy mm -hmm. crispy dosa. This coconut, Johnny? Oh. Absolute best. Like unreal. I think we got this as well. I think that's yeah. one of the best doses I've ever had too. Yeah, right? I'm serious. This is why I kept it for the finale. <laughs> <Right>? <laughs> Started with Karakti and we're ending with Karakti. Yes. Cheers guys. Cheers for Cheers. a great Cheers. day. Cheers. Great day. Thank nice. you great so day, much. Guys. Awesome. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Sweet. So nice. hot and so good. Creamy. Yeah. Mm. For me what makes this is the cardamom. Yeah. The cardamom is so good. Break that masala dosa. Oh yeah. Look in there. Mm. Look at that masala. This is the traditional dosa. Mm -hmm. Masala dosa. Oh, that's the joy right there. Yeah. Put in the coconut chutney. Oh, oh it's like working. Oh. Yum. <laughs> wow. We started with chai, we're ending with chai. Yep. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks so much. All right, that was an incredible long day of eating here in Sharjah. We did a big mix, Emirati, Indian, so good. Amazing exactly. meals. Oh. Amazing day. Amazing day, we're really full. So if you ever find yourself in Dubai, drive out here. It's about a 30 minute drive north. Exactly. Eat all this food and you will love it. If you guys love this video, please give me a thumbs up, comment below, subscribe to both their channels. And we'll see you in the next travel food adventure. Thanks. Somewhere guys. in Dubai, let's go. <laughs>